someone innocent, Oscar. Bah! If some innocents get killed, they are the victims necessary to establish the terror. Let's go! This is one case out of many that are repeated daily in some of the countries of Latin America. And those directly responsible are the youngsters trained in the School for Assassins. that my brother has gone to Cuba. Oh, poor Papa. He will see all his efforts to make him a man wasted. And Mama, how she will suffer when she finds out. Deep in the mountains of Cuba, hundreds of youngsters like Carlos and Oscar are being thoroughly trained to carry out the campaign of terror in their own countries. At the same time, they are being brainwashed by intensive indoctrination. Despite everything they've said, Oscar, I've noticed the people here don't seem happy at all. They seem to feel oppressed, and they don't live as well as we thought when we were in our own country. Bah! Seems there's always a counter-revolutionary around. Ah! Well, come on! We'll finish our training tomorrow. Yes. We'll be going back to our own countries in a few days. You are all prepared to return to your own countries and begin a wave of terror and communist agitation in accord with the decisions of the Tri-Continental Conference, which met here in Havana. But you have to be clever, so that your brothers will think that you're dealing with a true nationalistic revolution. Tomorrow you will get false documents to use. We'll send you to your countries by various means. Some of you will travel through our agents located in other countries. Long live the Communist Revolution! Long live the Communist Revolution! Papa, Papa, Carlos returns tomorrow from Europe. Returns from Europe? He hasn't been in Cuba. He's surely going to cause us a lot more problems. We really need a revolution, Gustavo. Yes, a true revolution. But we have a democratic government that has shown progress to be proud of, both economically as well as socially. I myself work on a wonderful experimental farm that's managed by our Uncle Emilio. Come on, Carlos. It looks like your brother Gustavo is just as reactionary as he's ever been. With the arrival of the elements that were trained in Cuba, the secret meetings begin. And before long, terrorism invades our cities. It doesn't matter how many innocent people suffer. What is important is to carry out the orders that were given to them in Havana. Comrades, the police have arrested many of us, and the people aren't responding as we thought. We must now change our tactics. The city is much too dangerous. Now we must go into the mountains. It's remarkable the progress we've made on our cooperative farm, right, Uncle? Your uncle seems satisfied, and I'm really glad too, Gustavo. Now surely within a year we can get married. Yes, now Gustavo is on his way. What actually has me a bit worried is those guerrillas that have sprung up around here. However, the programs of the military civic action are working toward resolving those problems. Is it true they say that your brother Carlos is one of them? Yes, Rosita. 
And I've been thinking, I should go find him. Maybe we could talk. Don't go, my love. We mustn't allow this to happen in our family, Gustavo. And although it's dangerous, you must go see him. Our objective is the destruction of that farm experiment, because it's a project of the imperialists. And this blow will be a warning to the people and the government not to attempt plans like these. During the assault, we can steal plenty of food, clothes, money, and a whole lot of the things we sorely need. Gustavo! Hold oh, that man! He is a worm who is here to spy on our movements! How dare you come here? I came to beg you to abandon this insanity, my brother. Ideas can't be imposed through terror and assassination. We are going to triumph! Because we are supported by very powerful countries! We plan to take over here the same as in Cuba! We are going to be the rulers! And you, Carlos, you go along with this stupidity? This is just the way it is, Gustavo. We'll be our own bosses here, and we'll make our communism in our own manner. Idiots! Now we must destroy your capitalist farm. You cowards! That farm belongs to our country and to our people. It's there we are all building for our future. You claim that you're so powerful, and you haven't even been able to feed any of the poor countries unlucky enough to fall into your dirty claws. This is an imperialist! Come on, we'll hit our objective. When we come back, we'll take care of this. Watch this guy! Good work. Come on, let's get back to the mountains. Calling Cuba. Calling Cuba. We proceeded according to the plans and destroyed the stronghold of the imperialists. Five worms were killed in the attack, including a spy we captured around our encampment named Gustavo. Gustavo, you killed my brother. I am as guilty as you are. Assassins! The soldiers! The soldiers! Surrounded. I think you have opened your eyes, Carlos, although the price you have paid has been high. Gustavo, my brother, forgive me, my brother. Scenes like this will continue happening as long as there are youngsters in training at the School for Assassins.